another Shabbos is coming. Uh, I'm going to do some inventory on what I'm cooking for Shabbos, what's in my fridge. It's just another week that the hostages have not been released. And when I light my candles for Shabbos this week, I'm gonna be praying for them once again. And for anyone out there who isn't Jewish and isn't lighting Shabbos candles, you can absolutely light a candle for the hostages as well. And for all of the innocent civilians that are in the middle of this war. All right, so let's see what's in here. Nora invited two friends to sleep over for Shabbos, so it's a good thing I defrosted a lot of chicken. Then I've got some cauliflower and Brussels sprouts. I also had pepper steak in my freezer, so I'm gonna cook that. And I bought this skirt steak and some chicken. It's uh, stuffed with kishka and pastrami. It's so good. Hopefully this will be enough. I'm gonna cook that chicken with the rice pilaf so that'll really bulk it up. Then I have some French beans and broccoli. And we actually ordered this Shabbos package from Carving Block in my neighborhood. I'll show you this later in my What I Made for Shabbos video, which will obviously have some things that I did not make. And Justin also went to the kosher mini market this morning, so I have a separate haul video coming for all that. It's definitely gonna be a full house this weekend. As long as I can read, that's what matters to me. I'm reading Zodiac Academy right now. I'm on the second book. Not really loving it yet. Please tell me it gets better.